I should have just kept videoing, but I decided to stop and have a look over there. So that's another neighbor. Um, here we go. So that's that's the the third house down this road. So I question if if the city does the city clear or I mean on top of your to twenty five hundred dollar tax, then you have to pay the fees to clear the, the road slash a driveway. Boy, this is the royal, royal tour. But as you get the, 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 you get the impression, you get the right impression, that it's very secluded, very nice. Hopefully nobody's coming the other way. so fast. Okay, because this is where I saw a lake. Well, stay on the road, Catherine. Over there. Now, that is a lake, and I, I'm going to assume that's the lake that the house has access to. It's beautiful. It's a very small little lake. I'm just going to pull over and get out and give you a little bit more of a... Here we go. Everybody's coming. I'll just have to move. Here we go. Oh, looks like people have been down here too. I don't know if there's a dock. I don't know anything, anything. Which is sort of fun at the same time. Try not to fall in. As you can see, there's ice. Ooh, ooh. Ice, ice. The other day when I showed you the other lake, it hadn't frozen yet. It probably has now too because ours froze yesterday or the day before. Now, if this is what they call Lake Rogers, this is not a lake. This is a pond. Be good for skating, except you might need to wear a wetsuit because you probably fall in. But that gives you a pretty good idea. Erlinda will uh, confirm if this is it. Because this ain't for fishing. But she's right on in the house. You know, have access to go. Not for a fisherman. No, no. But you are close to Barren Lake here. So you could just skedaddle over if you had a little dinghy. Okay, that's the road I just came down. And it has lovely looking gates that are clearly kept open most of the year. Okay, that's it for now.